so let's see today how we can update device software using airwave very quickly so let's go to my airwave server so let's first upload a new firmware in airwave so first thing to do as i said is to upload a new firmware so we can do this under device setup and then upload firmware and files or if we have already uh, defined a software uh, server which is automatically uploaded uh, available in, in our wave okay so let me add a new firmware so Aruba let's say yeah any model yeah okay description um, 7,005, 6, 4, 4, 4, I don't remember. Okay, upload firmware and choose file. So now let's find my software, which is under work, soft, and uh, Aruba, and yeah, this one. Okay, I upload the new software to Airwave. So I think it is a 118 megabyte. So perhaps this should take some time. Okay, down. So you can see new firmware added successfully. Okay, and you can see in the list the new here software. I just uploaded. Okay, so now we can deploy this software to our controller. So, if I... Yeah, let's go from group. You can see I have defined a wireless uh, group. Okay, you can see my controller here. If I go there... Okay, you can see the current software here. Fine. Okay, so you can see all the de details corresponding to my controller. Okay, and now let me go back to my groups because if I go to wireless again, I can see firmware here. Okay, and so I can select my new firmware to upload. You can see, oops, sorry, I have a meeting. You can see here, so the two firmware release I have on my server, I will try the last one because it is already in 6443. I click on save and upgrade device. Okay, I can verify, reboot no, yeah, my email and upgrade. Apply change now. And now we just have to wait. So it is pending. Okay, and if I select Okay, so now let's wait a little bit. Uh, let's refresh to check. Ah, uh, okay, so it is rebooting, so this means uh, because I don't have any more network because I was connected to my Wi Fi, so this means that the controller is rebooting, and so yeah, so. The device uh, is update, uh, was updated and so it is rebooting. So now we have to wait uh, the um, controller reboot. Okay, so network is up and running again. So let's refresh to check the status of the job and to verify that the firmware was successfully updated. Yeah, perhaps, uh, perhaps I need to log in again. Go back to the home page. Ah, that's not him. And so device setup. And then. Ah. Okay, I can't find the job. Okay, ah, insistent. Firmware upgrade job. Okay, and so okay, so it seems that it was successfully deployed. 
let me check on the device itself. So wireless, fab controller, and what is the firmware? Yeah. Okay, so the device is now updated to the latest release 6444. So as you can see, simple and easy, few very steps. So thank you and see you soon for another video. Bye.